looking for their sixth win in nine derby encounters. And Mike Walker is enjoying his second spell as manager. Williams. This is Adams. And Neil Adams getting back there, defending well, Adams. But when he goes forward, he doesn't have whips and quality service in the box. Williams. And now Scowcock has made the run along the line. Fleming holding him up, but he's found Bobby Petter. Steen's in the box, so to stop the line. And he gets the goal, and Marshall turns it behind. Yeah, good start for the match for Bobby Petter. And Mike Walker, in his two spells in charge, has seen plenty of these occasions. Both managers, in fact, have lost more than they've won. But here, Darren Eadie's away. And he's around the goalkeeper. And Eadie has scored for the match. And he's back with a goal in the ninth minute. It's a long goal. Company, was he tripped there? Tries to get in front of Eadie. Eadie's away. Right next to the commitment. But he tucks it in a cute angle. Kunde gets it onside, he's not going to catch Edie now, it's a question of can Richard Wright get to the ball, the answer is no, but look at this angle, Edie has a look, and he slots it right footed beautifully. Must have it Rob, when I did look at the Ipswich side, it did worry me about lack of pace. And Stockwell's pushed it through, Matthew with a chance to equalise! Can we leave him out? Can Potter equalise? Jackson's in the way. This is Jackson. And now brilliantly played behind Condé to Fleck. And right to command. It's a job of the place now with two centre halves. Condé and Mowbray. Fleck. Adams. Triple Fleck. which determined not to take this line down. It's Petter's cross. There's a good one from Venus at the line. Milligan was the man who cleared it, just as Venus thought he'd brought it for its level. That was a smashing header from Venus. And I thought it was in, looping in the far post. Goodness me. Steen, good turn. Is he through? Great save. Chance for Ipswich Town, goodness me. You have to say the goalkeeper was superb. And it could cause more torment here from the free kick. who's brought them back to life and he's looking for Fox! And he was going for the spectacular. Well, they're singing happily now and you'll see plenty of the yellow and green shirts around East Anglia over the next few days. And Craig Bellamy, who really has had a hectic week, set up the two goals that helped Norwich to win at Manchester City, scored twice for the Welsh under-18 team in the European Championship matches in Norway, and now he's coming on to take the place of Mike Milligan. Stockwell away from Forbes, this is Mackey. And Scott putting in no room, but cares what Scott is in! And there's the goal that Steve wanted, and that Ipswich wanted, to give themselves a foothold in this game. That's the one they needed. What a good goal, Matthew, tremendous. Kersley on the overlap, perfect bow, Steen, 2-1. Which really fancy their chances now of getting this equaliser, and who knows, there'd still be time enough to go on and win it. Mowbray's made his move now, and he's got there! Very, very unlucky, he gets inside Kevin Scott. Again, it was a nice height for Marshall. Good run, good delivery. This man, Adams, with Norwich now needing a goal to settle themselves. Edie's cross, Flick! Great save, great running for the follow up and winching very hard on Richard Wright, who to his internal credit never reacted. Yeah, great save. It's 
It's a brave one, it's a tremendous one. Saved initially, but a kill one for the fellow. Matthew was in there as well. Edie. There's Bellamy. Bellamy back from Fleck. Wow, what confidence the youngster showed. Yeah, good play. Edie. Thorn in the flesh all night. And he almost landed it off. What a stop again. This fella, what a game he's had. It just can't contain him. And right again. Tremendous one-handed save. Edie. Starting it all off with them with a goal.